Hello and welcome back to another tutorial. So in this series, you will learn how to create your inventory system. So this might take three or four videos. So the first part, we are go just going to create our GUI. So GUI frame. We will add a frame. And we will name this into main frame. So later on, I might include the shop system. That when you buy in something into the shop, it will go directly to your inventory. So now change the properties. Another frame for our holder. And then change the anchor point of our main frame. 0 0.5, 0 0.5. And then 0 0.5, 0 0.5. And then transparency into one. And change the color. And then the border si border size. Change. I will add text label. this is just a simple inventory GUI so if you want to improve it it's up to you for me I'm just gonna make it simple change this to inventory inventory and then change one so now I think this one is okay name this the holder and then we will hide the main frame So this button is for opening our inventory. Open and close. Open inventory. Find this one. Open inventory. It's scaled. Boy. I will change the color. We will hide the main frame. So busy ball and check this one. Then we will create our local script. So this script is the resp is responsible for hiding and showing our inventory. So button script that parent. And next one is the main frame. 
which is the inventory frame inventory frame is equal script that parent so our script is the local script and the parent is, is the text button and we need to reference the main frame so we need another that parent with for child main frame so again local script parent the text button and then the parent which is the screen GUI and then we will find the main frame next our mouse event so button mouse button click function And then inventory, inventory frame that visible is equals not inventory frame that visible. So run the script. So by clicking the button, it should show us our inventory frame so click the button hide hide show okay it is now working and then for the next step i will just create my template so when you touch an item it will go to your inventory and this template will be used to display that item. So, so this can be image button or text button if you want it to be a clickable. So you, you need to use text button. So for this tutorial, I'm just going to use image button. So, I will add a viewport. And then, we will fix this one. We should position this. Oops. then we'll add text label this is for the name of the model or the item so now i have my main frame the image button the template that i'm going to use and then text button to open and close our shop so I guess that's all I need for the GUI. So if you learned something in this video, press the like button and subscribe to our channel. If you have any questions, leave a comment down below. So that's all for this video. Thank you. See you in the next one.